two beautiful people who are in love, who overcome many obstacles, and who take pride in what they do and who they are, that is something we all marvel at and deeply admire. This is a day that the both of you will never forget. This is a day that is filled with love and admiration, surrounded by all those who truly want all the best in life there is for you both. May this be a moment to be remembered and cherished. This has been a moment that you both have been waiting for. About six years ago, my life changed forever. I met someone who was not only beautiful, but caring, charming, intelligent, and full of life. I know there was something special, divine, and serendipitous about that moment. On that day when I met you, Natalie Arias, God introduced me to love for the first time. From the first hellos we've ever exchanged, I haven't gone a single day without thinking about you. You've given me so much in these past few years that words can barely scratch the surface of my love and admiration. In times of poor health, you never left my side. In moments of despair, you stepped up, opened your light, and lifted my spirit. You've inspired me to do things I never thought were possible and always made me feel special, appreciated, and loved. And we aren't even married yet. Because of this, I love you now and until my last breath. Babe, my heart is filled with joy as I stand by your side today. A simple idea you had, Genesis, led us to this very moment, the epitome of follow your dreams. I still remember a little over four years ago when you ran to my desk at work and said, I want to own a liquor brand. Not quite the thing you say to an ambitious woman without expecting her to push you into greatness. We can agree Genesis sparked us, but credit to us for turning that spark into much more. I promise to protect you with every fiber in my body, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. I promise to be patient and understanding, even when we disagree. I promise to always treat you with honor and respect, regardless if you've had your coffee or not. I promise to bring you flowers for no reason, leave notes around the house, and have chocolate-covered almonds always at arm's reach. I promise to be a good father to our future children, and always remind them how lucky we are to have you. I promise to love you with every sunrise and pray for you with every sunset. As the scripture says, a man leaves his father and mother and is joined to his wife, and the two are united in one. I thank God every single day for making that introduction, and I vow to spend the rest of my life pro proving him right by loving you unconditionally. greatest adventure. Today we begin our life as one. Long before we were a thing, I prayed that God would place me in the right hands. That he would give to me a protector, a friend, a lover, and a soulmate. He over exceeded my expectations, as he always does. I feel God's presence as he's blessing our union. He's smiling at what he's created, and I will forever be grateful. Every love story is beautiful, but ours is my absolute favorite. I love you more than you love croquetas, <laughs> and that will never change. Yours truly, your everything. It is my privilege, by the authority vested in me, by the state of Florida, and my unmatched talent, 
but for the first time ever, I pronounce you husband and wife. Robert, you may kiss your bride. Rob and I have been best friends since we were kids. From the beginning, we've been inseparable. We were kind of like twins growing up. You could find us together at all the family events, at all the family parties. Looking for us was kind of like looking for the same person. Let me tell you something about my cousin. He's a man of great qualities. He's studious, ambitious, and a hard worker to say the least. But most of all, he is relentless in the pursuit of what he wants. Nat, I'm so happy that he's found his perfect match. A great guy deserves a great woman. And I can honestly say I've never seen him happier. And was forced to learn a new word, the word share. I had to share my room, share my bed, share my parents, and even share my clothes. As we grew older, I found out the good part of the word share. I found out I was sharing secrets, laughter, and hard times with whom today is my best friend. We know each other as well as we know ourselves. We've been there for each other through some of the hardest times in our lives and have been grateful to experience some of the best years of our lives together. I've had the opportunity to watch her grow, change, and evolve into the magnificent woman that sits before us today. I'm truly honored to call you my sister. Melo, thank you for making Natalie so incredibly happy. I'm so happy to know she has a man who's caring, loving, spontaneous, and supportive by her side. You guys not only help complete each other, but more importantly, you inspire each other to complete yourselves. 32 years later, facing the word share again but this time with you Melo today I'm going to share something I've never shared before I've shared many things in life but never this I'm going to share my most precious jewel for me this jewel is priceless unique and one of a kind Melo today and forever I will be more than happy to share my sister with you. I wish you all the happiness in the world. Thank you.